Let's look at the city council election in the 33rd council district. And we know that our friend Lincoln Wrestler won here, right? And you can see from the general election, he won 87% of the vote. Martha Rowan, the Republican, got... It doesn't even have a percentage. Oh, 12%? Okay, so 87, 12%. And, but the primary is very confused here. The mapping doesn't show the last rounds. So let's just see if we see the... Yeah, so here it is. They have... It'd be nice to get rid of these ads. They have the general election, but here's seven rounds, seven rounds of... of... Uh, primary, right? So if we go to round one, according to this, it says Lincoln Wrestler had 49% of the vote in 1400. So let's compare that against this mapping. Okay, sorry, this mapping thing, 40 cent. Let's see what it says in round one. Ah, yeah, but this is this is going in on one particular. See, it only has five rounds, which is wrong. So let's go back. So it did get 49% on 1,400. So at least the numbers match. But what you'll see right away is South Williamsburg, which seems to be a custom district here. Literally all of South Williamsburg is together, and it's deep yellow. And that means that it's like almost 100% Lincoln wrestler. So some deal must have been... Uh, talked about here because you're getting 90% 95% of the vote. That's obviously something happened there Right, and what kind of district is this that it's the uh, Hasidic Jewish area and Greenpoint and this little snake over here that connects them. I think that's the uh, That's Domino Park And that actually voted for this Elizabeth Adams hmm. Elizabeth Adams uh, so if we go back to round five, this is the final vote. And you can see something is messed up here. Be oh, maybe these other districts, yeah, but they're not even districts there. So s suddenly the outline of this area just changed. I don't know. I think this map is incorrect, I think. Something is not adding up. Because if you look at the picture in round one, it's bigger, it's got the whole of Greenpoint. Then you go to round five, which is missing round seven, and it's missing Greenpoint here. It doesn't make any sense. This doesn't make sense. But, and also, if you look at round five, the total number of votes are only 5,500, so I don't know what just happened there. If you go back to round one, I don't know how these votes disappeared, unless people have stopped voting. Maybe the people in Greenpoint didn't vote for round uh, five or whatever it is, round, or oh, first choice, second choice, third choice, maybe some people didn't put second choice. So if you don't put a second choice, I guess your vote disappears. Maybe if your candidate's eliminated and you didn't put a second choice, maybe that's what's happening here. But what we can see is that, first of all, in the block voting, this dark yellow is block voting, right, 100% and almost 100%. And uh, let's see if, yes, yeah, see, Victoria Cambridge, she didn't win any election district at all. Let's see here, yes. So, oh, I see, if you click on the person, you can see their votes. Oh, so that's even cooler. You can do that, and then it'll just narrow it down to that person's vote. So what kind of voting did she get? She got very little. Ah, I see what it's doing. It's coloring it by that person. That's kind of cool. But let's see if we go to Victoria. They're just It won't do it for candidates that are so low that they don't have enough votes to, to get any color. That's interesting. Look at that. You can do that and see color. Yeah, they got... So the point is that I think this map might be correct because this is what happens when you don't vote enough. You don't give around a uh, second choice, third choice, first choice. If you just come in and just give the first choice. Now let's see this. April, she actually won her little area over here.
That's interesting. Does that feel? So what the heck happened to... Wait a second, so round four... Something's not adding up because our friend uh, Victoria... I don't know, does this show Victoria? Wow, she got one vote there? That's interesting. I'm not understanding this, but the the thing that we could take away from this is that we can see that the votes from hmm, here they didn't they they're not even showing South Williamsburg. Eighty one. Hmm. So America, I think we should question this election because it's not clear to me what the results are showing. So we'll have to look at the raw data. Peace out.